Hi, I'm Malay from Mill Lane Studio. If you've ever experienced the frustration of a piece of jewellery falling apart on you, then this video is for you. Chances are, the culprit was a poorly closed jump ring. So in today's jewellery know-how, we're going to take a look at the correct way to open and close jump rings, so your jewellery never falls apart again. To open and close jump rings, you need two pairs of pliers. Pick up the jump ring in your left hand with the opening facing towards the top and then using pliers in your right hand grip the jump ring between 2 o'clock and 3 o'clock. With pliers in your left hand grip the jump ring between 9 o'clock and 10 o'clock. Pull one hand toward you and move the other hand away. This opens the jump ring and keeps it in its perfectly circular shape. Add your component and you're ready to close the jump ring. To close the jump ring, we do exactly the opposite. Bring the two parts back towards the centre, pushing in slightly as they come towards the, mid the middle, and then go past centre. Come back towards centre, still pushing inwards, and do it again. When you hear the click, you know that you've properly tensioned the jump ring. Make sure that it's lined up properly at the top and you have a perfectly closed jump ring and jewellery that won't fall apart. 